Okay, so probably the most common thing that's going to happen when you're playing Yogi Octopus is you get your back taken from that reach around grip. Let's just say I'm playing the knee shield. Okay, I've got that um, two on one grip. I've managed to get to the reach around grip and I'm lure. Okay, maybe I'm sloppy with my hooks and throwing stuffs my knee and steps over. And now from there, he is on my back. Again, you know, that's probably the most common thing that's going to happen from the the leech half guard. So, uh, or from the octopus guard. So we can close that down this step over counter by doing two things. Okay, let's look at the casita hook first. So say you make the grip. I come up and the octopus guard. To stop him stepping over, I just, um, just turn this over. I just use my right foot and pass um, Jerome's right leg to my left and he put in that, I would call it a leech hook, a knee torque, um, Craig Jones calls it a pursuit of hook. Now if um, Jerome tries to take my back from there by stepping over, he physically can't. Okay. So that's our first um, um, way of stopping the step over. The second way is from our position, I come up, I get the reach around grip. If he's a little bit uh, savvy, he will um, swim his right foot close to his butt. So now he's tucked it in. So actually I physically can't get it with my left leg. Okay, if that's the case, I just hip out a little bit and I put in a butterfly hook. Now from there, if Jerome tries to take my back, my butterfly hook physically tracks Jerome's leg. There's just no way he can get to my back with, because wherever he lifts that leg, I just keep it there. And I can use this to sweeten and come on top. So those two concepts about playing the, the, the game defensively is really, really important before you even get into thinking about sweeping. So from our position, from that two on one, I'm gonna come up, I get my reach around grip, and before I even initiate any sweeps, I either want that, or if he's hiding the foot, I want that. And now we are ready to start being offensive. Because uh, if you don't put in either the butterfly hook or the casita hook, you're gonna get your back taken. So again, one more time on that. From our position, once I come up and he make that grip, I either want this, Jerome's going to try and take my back, it's just not going to happen. Or he could be cross facing me and keeping my head high. If on the off chance he swung that foot inside and I can't physically get it, with the leech hook, I just move my hip back and put in the butterfly hook. And now from there, I do whatever he wants. And he's not taking my back either. So that's dealing with the step over.